Eh? How did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back. Just to be safe. <laughs> you ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Mm, well, I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know? Oh, that makes sense. You. You're free to go. <laughs> Not really, but you've got a package. Don't get your hopes up. We've already checked it for anything useful, haven't we, Dave? What? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course I checked it. I mean, if I didn't check it, I'd lose my job, and I don't lose my job. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> ah.
Yo, check yourself. What the? Now, all in favor of more donuts in the break room, say aye. 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 Nay. Shut up, janitor. You don't count. Now, the next one on the air. Now look, you're back. Hmm. Ready? Fire! Oh, oh man. Ah! 
Witness, please continue your testimony. Okay. I was riding alongside my partner in the armored van, but suddenly he spotted a bag on the side of the road. We got out and eventually decided to throw the bag in with the others. We didn't know there was someone hiding in there. OBJECTION! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then. What are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. Take that! What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman,
Take that! What is this? It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Well, I... <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try... This is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman... Take that! Is... is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there! By this very witness! What? As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious! Th this is absurd! The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There were millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, you, you can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman. The Tunisian Archaeological Exhibit Open! Yes, thank you. Yes. We got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over.
Whoa. Uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving a- Crap. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, uh -huh. bribery is a federal offense, sir. <laughs> sir. Place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. <laughs> Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You leave me no choice, sir. <laughs> Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You leave me no choice, sir. <laughs> Thank you.
yeah, so apparently there's something in that cake, and uh, he used it to escape, and then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, point. please shut up. Oh, I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know, since I mean, we're partners, so I just, just wanted to get, get to know each other. Ah! I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation. I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know, since, I mean, we're partners, so I just, just wanted to get, get to know each other a little bit, you know? I just kind of wanted to have a conversation. It's just, you know, just to lighten things up, I mean, what's gonna happen in a museum? I mean, really. You feel a draft at all? Hey! I just, I was, I was just trying to- uh, I gotta warn some- Sir, you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. My god, it's over 9? Yeah. I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work! Whoa, sorry, Chief.
Falcon. Oh, no, good company. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah. Well, well, look who finally decided to wake up. You've been quite elusive, but your skills make you worth the catch. You'll be perfect for the job. We've been having some issues with a group of thieves known as the Top Hat Clan. We know they're guilty, we just can't pin them down in crimes. You'll be going into the airship to bring them down. I don't need to remind you that we've got you on several charges. Attempting robbery, breaking yourself out of prison, even stealing the Tunisian diamond. We've got quite a lot of counts on you. Do this job right, and we'll drop all charges against you. Charlie here will be bringing you close to the airship. The rest is up to you. Find a way to bring him down, and you'll be a free man. Hey, uh, how do you want me to bring you in?
kind of thinking. <laughs> right, so if we go up to three caliber... Hey, you there. What do you think you're doing? It's Smith, right? What are you doing here, mate? Your wife's just gone into labor. Take that escape pod behind you. It'll take you right to the hospital. Go ahead. Don't worry. I'll tell the chief. Why not, man? You do realize how much a solid gold cannon would weigh, don't you? Dude, we totally got enough power. What do you think, man? Well, I'm still kind of new here, so I'm not really sure what to say. Hmm. Door's jammed again. Oh, hey, uh, you see that record sign? Where it says records? That'd probably be a good place to look, right? Let me just, uh, help you get across that gap. Okay, uh, let me just, uh, teleport this thing in here for you. Yeah. yeah, I have this thing here that can manipulate gravity. Should be able to get you to float across. Let me just... wait. Up. Down. Hmm. Did it work? Alright, here I come. Da 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 Alright, uh, hacked into their security system. I should be able to open the door from here. Alright, get to bring out the big guns. Hey, should be good to go now. Think nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. <coughs> Boo! Boo! Oh man, that thought just flew right into the propeller. Oh, what a mess! Oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. <coughs> oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Ooh. Falcon! Oh man, I remember this. Good thing nobody knows about this or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Ooh. Oh, hello Mr. Spider. Alright, you got some evidence. Oh, wait, wait. There's no way you're getting through there. Lots of guys and there's lots of guns, that's all I'm gonna say. It looks like you can get around if you go through that air duct. Alright, 
Alright, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Meh. Okay. I, I don't understand what that means. I'm sorry, I just thought you needed some help is all. Alright, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Okay, shutting down the power now. Alright, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Okay, I'll reroute the power to a random room, that's fine. Alright, Henry, you're almost there. I'm right outside, so just open the bay doors and I'll, uh, get you on the chopper. Hey, what are you doing? Yeah, uh, we got a situation down in the cargo bay. Hey, I've been, I've been looking at the numbers here. What do you think? Ah, yes. Let me have a look. Go, go! I'll hold him off! Come on, then! Activate the doors!
Hurry up now, activate the doors. Hurry up now, activate the doors! Nav got ya. Render the airship to you.
fingers. You think they're alright? Pretty big fall. I'm sure Henry had a plan. What is it? I think they're alright. Pretty big fall. I'm sure Henry had a plan. What is it?
like he set off some sort of alarm in the vault? What? He's going rogue? Alright, move to plan B. Call and reinforcements and move in. Yeah, this is Jeffrey. Uh, I got him right here, so you guys don't need to worry.
the ruby. Now forget about it. We've got to retreat, or else the topic clan will be history. Or is Ken? Let him go. What? We got what we came for. He's not worth the trouble. Hello, Henry. Welcome to the wall. Some of the most cunning and notorious criminals are kept here, and now we have the infamous Henry Stick. You're going to be here for a long time. Grigori, take him. You wait here until cell found. <laughs> so at this point, he has only like 10 health left. And he plays, the gates are open. And I'm like, look at how much I care. I don't care. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing... <laughs> I ended up buffing up my guys and doing... Was that the convict? Uh, yeah, I think so. What are we supposed to do when someone tries to escape again? Uh, I think shoot him. Ah, yes, that sounds right. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing like 70 damage. <laughs> I ended up buffing up my guys and... Oh, come on. Are you serious? That was totally you. You what? Don't you accuse me. Come on, just admit it. It wasn't me. Boys, lunch is on me. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Someone just leave. I think it was Smith. Oh yeah, probably off to see his family. Yeah. 